Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Balboa Show, baby, and we're coming off the worst roster reveal in WWE 2K Games history, and we're starting with the champ, Tommaso Ciampa, and the reason why he may have not, and may not be in the game at all this year, is because of a tweet that he posted, which has currently been taken down, whether he deleted it, or they told him to delete it. Uh, basically, he said this. At WWE Games, had their final roster reveal for WWE 2K19. A lot of people are wondering why the champ is not in the game. Well, it's quite simple. I am the champ for a reason. I don't lose. Not in real life. And sure as hell, not in your fantasy world. <gasps> yeah! So that's the reason. So basically, it's going off his WWE gimmick. His what he's doing currently. His heel. Uh, he doesn't want anyone to play as him. He doesn't want to lose to anybody. And so, it's actually quite cool if you think about it. But it's not going to be cool for the people playing the game. So you got a lot of frustrations on Twitter. A lot of, uh, you know, why we didn't get Dakota Kai, Danny Burch, Trent Seven, Lacey Evans, Nikki Cross, Buddy Murphy, RVD and other legend NXT and UK superstars. And it is very unfortunate, man. I mean, no Mick Foley. JBL, you know, you know, legends that were in last year, Mark Henry, like, where are they, man? Why didn't they reveal them? I mean, a lot of people saying there may be a surprise reveal later, but I don't understand, like, this is supposed to be the roster reveal. Shouldn't they reveal all the roster and keep, like, some surprises? But this is, like, taking out all the legends. And we've got an update for that from King Mo. So, Connormania18 asked, is it a good reveal today? Talking about yesterday's terrible reveal. King Mo actually said he put like that. He put a hands up. He put a thumbs up emoji. This especially in addition to this year's DLC lineup will make a lot of folks pleased. But uh, this revealed was not good. So will the DLC. I mean why would he. I don't understand why King Mo said this is good. Uh, but he says that the DLC lineup will make a lot of folks please so i'm thinking ricochet c3 war raiders however king mo then did have another tweet that said this on september 9th he was asked by chapman nation at king mo on a scale of 1 to 10 how amazing is the last roster reveal king mo then said probably a 7 most of the reveals are obvious i'd give it a 9 if they didn't end up cutting as much legends content so it seems that they cut out a lot of legends this year and it's obvious to those who are not in the game mick foley mark henry jbl rvd from last year man like where the hell are they uh, oh my god, I mean they never even announced John Cena in any of these roster reveals, which is kind of odd as well. Uh, that's kind of weird man, I swear, but obviously, if you've taken it into that context, if John Cena wasn't revealed, but he was in the game, of course he is in the game. So there must be a lot of superstars as well. Currently there's 177 superstars confirmed. This is not the largest roster ever, but it should be and it will be most likely. I mean, there's so much roster members that are yet to be revealed, including DLC. So guys, keep your heads up high. There's so much roster to be announced yet. So much. I mean, maybe they're going to reveal them. Maybe they won't even reveal them. And when the game comes out, that's when you find out. I mean, that would be cool. I'll be honest. That, I wouldn't mind that as long as we get them. They don't need to be revealed as long as they're in the game. Also coming out for Adam Cole, baby. So in the first ever roster reveal, the part one, he was seen wearing the North American Championship. However, in the entrance video that they currently have on, you know, the full entrance where it's Adam Cole, Undisputed Era entrance. However, it's really an Adam Cole entrance with two managers, which are the Undisputed Era. He's not wearing the North American Championship. Maybe this is a hint to having Ricochet in the game. Otherwise, it's just going to be a title because we know the title's in the game. However, it's just going to be vacated. And it probably will be if Ricochet is not uh, on the main disc. Then it probably will be vacated. And it's just a hint that we will be getting Ricochet. It seems like Ricochet will be in this year's game. 
and according to King Mo, the lineup is going to make a lot of people pleased for DLC. So yeah, most likely, I'll say 80%, 94%. I know that's a big difference if you're talking about percentages. But yeah, Ricochet, I could say, he's most likely in the game. And hopefully King Mo or somebody gives us an insight on who DLC will be. So big shout out to my comment section members, Kevin Castellonia. Dirt J as well and Lossy Burns guys thank you so much for commenting thank every single one of you for commenting be sure to leave a like comment and subscribe uh, again there's gonna be a whole load of more roster members to be revealed yet yeah, I mean this is not enough for this year to be the biggest roster ever so guys keep your heads up high there's still more to come don't let them fool you man don't let them fool you but if you decided not to buy this game this year, I wouldn't blame you at all. Uh, save your money if you can. Uh, maybe we should teach him a lesson. You know what I mean? Yeah, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out. God bless every single one of you.